Yo, what's up guys and welcome back to another 7th Haven video. In this video, I will be showing y'all how to increase drop rates while harvesting. And we're about to jump straight into this. I just want to show y'all something. These uh, foods are what help you out the most. Roasted carrots, cooked corn, cornbread, stuff like this. I actually went ahead and did harvesting in this video. And as you can read, it says increases your luck when harvesting by 1400 points for 25 minutes. They have one for each gathering mechanic, like these carrots. Increase your luck when skinning by a thousand points for 20 minutes. But let's jump straight into this video. Alright, jumping straight into the video, I was showing you all the food in the intro because that is what's going to increase your rate while gathering. There's actually 8 different foods that increase your luck, and it's 2 per category, harvesting, skinning, logging, and mining. Each one of them has 2 foods that increase, 1 by 1000, 1 by 1400. I went ahead and did harvesting with the cornbread, which is the upgraded 1400 luck for 25 minutes. As you see, I just got the Life Bloom Flower just now. That is a tier 4 drop. It was actually very hard to find for me. I had ate the cornbread, which is the upgraded version, and it took me about... only found two in the entire 25 minute duration. So that can show you how hard it is to actually get this stuff, even with the food. I have been harvesting for a while, that's the main thing I was focusing on in the beta, and I never found a life bloom flower until I actually used the cornbread to increase my luck. The reason why this is so important is because this can take you the step further when you're trying to craft certain stuff. I actually needed the life bloom flower to craft a stronger generation potion, I'm pretty sure. Uh, you have to get your Arcana skill and stuff like that up too. But like I said, this goes for skinning, logging, gathering, and mining. So if you're looking for a certain type of wood for your new bow or anything, you're going to want to have these foods. And I actually didn't craft the cornbread. I went ahead and went to the trading post and I searched it up and I bought some. I went out here and like I said, I grinded the whole 25 minutes. This is just a small portion of the video, and I only found two life bloom flowers, so it's actually very hard to get. It has a low drop rate, and I went back to the market after I had found this, and I searched life bloom flower. There wasn't a single life bloom flower on the market in my entire server. So this stuff can be really hard to find. I do advise that you either learn how to make these, or you just keep a lot of them on deck while you're logging, gathering, skinning, or mining because these will increase your luck. This will get you those rare drop rates. And without them, honestly, I don't even know if it's possible to get a life bloom flower if you don't have this um, cornbread or I think the other one is potatoes. If you don't have the luck boost, I don't even know if it's possible to get a life bloom flower because, like I said, I did a lot of gathering in this beta and I never found one until I used this food. And all this stuff is super important. Make sure you just have a lot of them on you constantly so you can increase your rate. I would advise when you eat one, just strictly gather or whatever it is that you're doing, just strictly do that the entire time because yes, it increases your luck by a lot, but you definitely don't want to waste it. If you get to the point to where you can just craft a lot of them, then you can just have one constantly going then you can just use them and level while you're gathering and stuff or whatever but that's pretty much it for the video thank you guys for stopping by i felt i found this super useful i actually had someone come up to me and ask hey i've done gathered like how do you get a life bloom flower and i was like by gathering the life bloom flower it's pretty self-explanatory but he was told had the same problem as me he had gathered upwards to 30 different life bloom flowers and never got one and that's where i got the idea to go ahead and make this video i do think it's super important because it goes more than just gathering i mean harvesting it goes for 
mining, logging, and skinning as well. So you can get rare game meat to make better foods. You can get the rare wood to make better items, so on and so forth. Thank you guys for stopping by. That's it for today's video. I hope you found something useful in this video. Please like and subscribe. Let me know in the comment section below what you would like to see next and your thoughts on the game so far. Bye.